Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews. In this video, we're talking about malware. So I have had quite a lot of requests from you guys to do a video on this topic. So there is a new malware reported, which is infecting iDevices and then using them to perform botnet attacks. So the way it works is that attackers infect iDevices using this malware and then they use those devices. So they will use your device to perform a botnet attack. So in this video, I will tell you guys how you can get infected with this malware, how you can notice if your device is infected and also how to protect your device so that it doesn't get infected with this malware. So there are a lot of ways a device can get infected with this malware, but in this video, I will focus on two of the most common ones, cracked tweaks and also untrusted IPAs. So if you're downloading tweaks, from a repo that offers crack tweaks, tweaks that you can get for free, which are paid tweaks, then you are exposing your device to a danger of getting infected with this malware. Also, don't add unknown repos, repos that you don't know you trust. Don't go ahead and add to Cydia and install tweaks from them. And also untrusted IPAs, don't download IPAs from just any website and sign them to your device. They may contain malware within them and can infect your device. So crack tweaks and also untrusted IPAs. Just don't do it. Don't install crack tweaks and untrusted IPAs. So here are a few signs that might suggest that your device can be infected with this malware draining of the battery. If your device is draining the battery without any reason, if your device is on sleep and stuff like that, you're not doing anything on it and it's still draining the battery, then that is very suspicious. Also, big changes on the free storage. So if you're seeing big changes on the free storage without any reason, without installing or uninstalling anything, without adding or deleting anything from your device, then that is very suspicious as well. Also, your device might get heated right here on the part where the processor is without any reason, without playing any heavy game or doing any heavy task on your device. You might The device might get heated, then that is very suspicious as well. Also, your device might slow down and the internet speed as well might slow down. You can also go ahead and talk to your internet provider and ask them about the activity of your device and you can better know if your device is being used on these attacks or not. So here is how to protect your device from this malware. The first thing you'll need to do is go ahead and remove any crack tweaks that you might have installed on your iOS device and also delete any untrusted IPAs that you might have installed on your device. To protect your device from this malware, you will also need to change the root passcode of your device. You can do that by installing mterminal from Cydia. So you install mterminal and then you will get this icon on the home screen. So all you have to do is just open this icon and just tap here, su root. And once you tap here, return, you can see it will ask you for the passcode. Now the default passcode is Alpine and this is the passcode that we need to change. So let's just enter here Alpine. And so we are on the device right now and here we can change the passcode. So what you need to type here is just type pass WD click return and now you can enter a new passcode. So let me just enter here a new passcode. Now notice that as I'm typing my new passcode, it doesn't show any letters up here, but it will add the passcode. So you tap return and you will need to retype the new passcode. And click return once again. And as you can see right now, the passcode has been changed from Alpine to iReviews. So you will need to change your passcode using mterminal which you can download from for free from Cydia. So that's it for this video guys. I hope these tips can help you guys keep your device protected from this malware and from other malwares as well. As I said once again don't install crack tweaks and untrusted IPAs and also go ahead and change the root passcode 
of your iOS device. So that's it. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Also, go ahead and follow me on my social media. You will find all the links in the description of the video.